Much is new in the latest version of BricsCAD. To start, BricsCAD V18 fully supports the DWG 2018 format. The manipulator widget lets you rotate, move, mirror or scale entities along an axis or a plane. You can use dynamic dimensions to locate items precisely. Section views can be clipped and can be set differently per viewpoint. Clipped section views can be printed too. Navigate lets you walk or fly through your models using a familiar video game paradigm. Cursor keys, toggles and mouse clicks all play a part in moving through your 3D creations. The Clean Screen options allows you to toggle between your conventional BricsCAD workspace and a clean graphics window only view. You can only configure exactly what the screen looks like in both modes. BricsCAD V18 uses a next generation repository approach to enable blazingly fast drawing compare with visual merge capabilities. This tool scans two versions of a drawing and rapidly compares the history of all graphical entities. You can see the changes in the structure panel. View them on screen in contrasting colors. and leverage the Keep Me command to keep the entities you select while automatically discarding the others. This is groundbreaking technology. In BricsCAD BIM V18, there are many new features. The new Create Window command creates fully parametric windows from any closed contour. Rooms can detect their 3D boundaries and be displayed as a 3D solid in the model, on demand. The volume of each room is displayed in that room's properties. Parametric arrays let you control the number of entities in the array with the parameter. This gives users greater flexibility in creating stairs, curtain walls and the like. The new structural modeling toolset in BricsCAD BIM recognizes linear solids and can classify them as columns, beams, railings, pipes, ducts and more. A new series of modeling commands help users create and modify structural elements quickly and easily. An application of machine intelligence in BricsCAD BIM is available through the BIM Suggest command. Select any two solids and BIM Suggest will analyze their connection and highlight similar situations in the model where the same connection can be applied.
In terms of adding data to your BIM, BIM Classify now groups entities into four categories – Core, Architectural, Structural and Building Services. XREFs are supported as BIM objects and may be classified and have a spatial location. For moving BIM data between applications, IFC import capabilities have been greatly improved. Windows imported via IFC are both parametric and associative. The BIMify command automatically classifies BIM components and assigns their spatial locations in the model. With regard to BIM model documentation, data extraction now supports ply quantities and materials. The Balloon command creates associative balloon entities to tag assembly components in model space. These balloons also appear in associated paper space viewports. Associative arrays can be driven by parametric expressions and can be used to create fully parametric table-driven entities in both 2D and 3D. BricsCAD's powerful sheet metal module now exports complex assemblies containing sheet metal parts or components. The unfolded flat pattern and summary report is created automatically for each sheet metal part in an assembly. In V18, sheet metal parts can be created from a polyline boundary using SM Extrude. The system will convert linear segments to flanges, arcs to bends, and hard edges in flanges are converted automatically to bends. Creating associative rib features is the job of the SM Rib Create command. Starting with the 2D profile, these features are updated automatically when their defining profile is changed. For more about BricsCAD V18 or to try the software for free for 30 days, just go to Brixis.com.